a grand day it was here at Idlewood Golf Course. I'm T-Bow. I was all over the course today. By the lake, on the beach, on the green, in the hole, and sometimes even underwater. But I must say, Ironwood was ready for some serious golfing action. The rough was thick and the greens were fast and true. The players, oh my. Let's send it to the course announcer for some thoughts and highlights from today's round. Thanks, T. Homer here. This outing was one spectacular golfing event. Traveling the course, I was watching and talking to the golfers showing off their game. The memories left a day to behold. Here's a sample of some of the players' thoughts and feelings I heard from today's round. My favorite, tee it high and let her fly. Just remember, a gimme is an agreement between two golfers, neither of whom can putt worth the darn. It wasn't hard to keep my ball in the fairway, as long as I wasn't picky about which fairway. Golf is an easy game. It's just hard to play. If I hit it right, it's a slice. If I hit it left, it's a hook. And if I hit it straight, it's a miracle. I found a wood that can lower my score. It's called a pencil. I was one under today. One under a tree, one under a bush, one under water. I got a two handicap, really. Woods and irons. It's 167 yards away from the hole, no, from the beer cart. This beats any shopping cart. Golf's three ugliest words, still your shot. I'm a scratch golfer. I swing my club and scratch my head. I didn't miss the putt, the ball missed the hole. It takes a lot of balls to golf like I do. My main problem is I stand too close to the ball after I hit it. And if NASA really wants to find water on Mars, just send me there to hit a golf ball. Oh, baby! These golfers, the talent and the right personality to make this a great day for a great cause. appreciates your business and hope to see you again real soon. Gotta fly for now. Bye-bye. <laughs>